YouTube. Welcome to Motorcycling with Carl. What a beautiful late October fall day here in Connecticut. Uh, it is just a beautiful day. I can't believe the amount of motorcycles that are out today on the road. Um, everybody's trying to get their last rides in and stuff, I guess, before the, the season ends, but Man, what a beautiful day. All right. So, today I want to talk about something that I'm going to be doing. It's going to be coming up on my channel. I'm actually going to be doing something that's... Uh, it's not motorcycle content, but I think it's something that's uh, pretty cool and interesting. So... I'd like to try to make a video and bring you guys along with me on this. Uh, my son's future father-in-law has uh, bought himself a brand new Corvette. Well deserved, worked hard for. Um, and they're not really easy to get now. So he had this you know, he did the build on it and everything, so he's getting exactly what he wants. But he has to go all the way up to New Hampshire, Nashua, New Hampshire, I think it is. There's a dealer up there that turns over like hundreds and hundreds of Corvettes, maybe thousands, I don't know. I heard this place is huge and, you know, it's a Chevy dealer, but they really specialize in Corvettes. So he's going to make it to my house and then from my house in Connecticut, it's like two and a half hours up there. So I'm going to drive him up, uh, make sure he gets in his new Corvette good and everything. And then we'll do some video. I think he's going to take me for a ride up there. So I think it's going to be pretty exciting and everything I heard about this Corvette, um, I think it's pretty nice, it's pretty cool, so maybe you guys will enjoy seeing it. Let me know in the comments if uh, you think you'll enjoy seeing me going up there to pick up this Corvette with them. I think it's cool. I would love a Corvette. Presently, I don't think I could afford a Corvette, though. But I'm happy with my motorcycles. I just, I know every time I'm on the video, I talk about a project and find it's on. I have got to find something to do. It's driving me crazy. I gotta come up with a project. One, so I can put more content out. I only like putting out content if I feel it's quality and good. I haven't had much lately, but you know, winter's coming up. I gotta find something to work on. I love to tinker. How's everybody else been out there? Everybody been doing good? I gotta say, since I moved, it's been tough you know I've been out learning roads and everything but where I grew up in that area before I moved here I knew all the roads I knew where I wanted to, I knew everything this is such a learning experience for me up here but the roads are absolutely beautiful I mean I could just go minutes away from my house and kind of just be on these nice back roads you know 50 mile an hour speed limits. They're really nice. There are some really nice rides up here. I could just zip all around. It's been crazy. Look at that. Scenic road. <laughs> oh. I am just loving it. I can't believe for the time of year that it is. How beautiful it is out today. Harley's running great. My Seika's running great. 
two totally different machines and just on any given day you know just your mood it's like oh yeah I'm gonna take that one today or oh let's take that one it's so nice to have the option it'd be even nicer to have a third option I hope my wife didn't hear that <laughs> These roads are awesome. Woo! Gotta love it, man. This bike definitely has got a hell of a lot more go than my uh, Seika. But the crazy thing is the Seika handles twice as good. So, you give up a little of this for a little of that. A lot of motorcycles out today up here. It's a beautiful day. Alright, so let me know in the comments if you're interested in seeing this van. So, it probably won't be long after I put this video out that I will be posting that video to my channel. Hopefully I get more content out. I know I've been I've been terrible this year. It's been a really weird year. Working all kinds of crazy hours, then being out of work. It's like I don't know. There's just no in between. But I am I am enjoying a little bit of time off here. Spending some time with my wife, getting to do some riding, doing some other things that I like to do. Go to the casino once in a while, but that uh, that never works out well for me, <laughs> if you know what I mean. Alright, so I'm going to keep this one short. But I just wanted to let you know, you know, I'm still here and I'm looking forward to seeing this vet and hopefully you guys are too. All right. So until next time, this is Carl saying laugh a lot, be nice and stay safe.